hey guys hope you are doing well so the crypto market is just slightly going up so that's good news nice correction to the upwards my name is mike dankler from core ionx and i'm bringing you the most important crypto news technical analysis altcoin nft defagents to keep you updated every day uh, so let's get into smash those like push the bell notification all and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so smashing those like quite important for the youtube algorithm and also push the bell notification or that you will be notified whenever we are uploading a new video or should i still state that nothing in this video can be considered as a financial or investment advice everything just for your education and entertainment purposes only always do your own research and make your decisions based on your financial status and also based on your research so guys let's get into our favorite power chart and you see bitcoin is up 1.4 percent it's traded around 41,500. ethereum is almost uh, just plus zero traded uh, below uh, 3100 but few altcoins like tron theta uh, knc kava dcr ton zrx uh, basic attention tokens rule pumping really well ape is correcting after the rumor that we will look into it uh, what uh, uh, the fear and greed index is showing to us that we are still at 27 so this is the third uh, consecutive day that the index is not moving anywhere so investors are still uh, in fear uh, but not in extreme fear so maybe we will uh, experience some uh, consolidation in the neutral zone and and investor sentiment will getting better our first news is that bitcoin has for two weeks highs as terra luna promises btc price will soon get spicy so what does that mean if the bitcoin price uh, is getting spicy spicy so if the market wants to see continuation is has to crack that region around 42,500 for bitcoin this is also a daily breaker if it breaks i'm assuming a new test of 46,000 is around the corner and possible uh, 50,000 plus so the D, uh, uh, the D Dixie is getting uh, just weaker and weaker. I don't think the upside is done as the Dixie is showing weakness. And also Terra Luna uh, just tweeted that things are gonna get spicy real soon. Bears be aware, bears be aware. So number of unique addresses holding minimum 10,000 Bitcoin has been increasing since February. We will look into it on my Twitter feed. Whales have loaded positions at 43,000. Whales generally accumulating, but some sold lately. Could the higher low get revisited? Yes, yeah, so that's the big question for now. Let's go and check our next news. GBTC premium nears 2022 high as SEC faces call to approve Bitcoin ETF. Grayscale CEO, if not one for US Bitcoin spot ETF, so this is the Grayscale Investment Trust and the premium is uh, the smaller in this year but it was much higher uh, in the past few months so now it's getting uh, just uh, uh, lower. If the SEC can't look at two like issues, the future ETF and the spot ETF through the same lens then it is, is in fact potentially grants for an administrative procedure act violation. Nasdaq highlights surging institutional demand. As demand continues to surge, advisors will be looking for an institutional solution to the crypto question that now dominates client con uh, conversations. And also, guys, yesterday I talked about that Australia is launching a spot Bitcoin and spot Ethereum ETF on the Chicago uh, CBOE exchange and how can it be as the SEC is the United States uh, just uh, financial authority so next piece of news is bottom is in and reversal underway for Bitcoin according to crypto analyst so this is a cred credible uh, analyst task to uh, its uh, Twitter followers that okay he believes bitcoin is building a base for reversal in the high 
30,000 to low uh, 40,000 start the cautions that it will take some days uh, to develop cool what else do we have here DeFi convex finance is pumping uh, so some just uh, some swamp feet about convex finance so this is why convex uh, is going up okay good to see this tweet but nothing special next BTC and Ethereum will break all-time highs in 2022 says you CEO says this so guys I really like Alex Alex Mashinsky you can listen this but it's a little bit long and he think that I definitely think that the demand is here so I don't see us revisiting previous lows it's going to take us longer to hit new highs but I still expect us to break that 60,000 US dollar this year on Bitcoin break the 40 uh, 3,500 3, on Ethereum he basically saying look we don't have to be 100% DeFi CeFi and DeFi are two sides of the same coin and you sometimes you need uh, to CeFi sometimes you need to use DeFi and that's what Celsius does every day so guys <coughs> Celsius is a great CeFi project so definitely you can check it out so next piece of news is Bitcoin price prediction 41,000 US dollar in 2022 and three uh, 320,000 by 2030 so Bitcoin price prediction according to panel of experts Bitcoin will hit 40,000 this year this will be a new historic record this is according to the latest Bitcoin price prediction report from finder.com there is still a lot of uncertainty about Bitcoin's near-term outlook given the macroeconomic headwinds it could it wouldn't surprise me to see Bitcoin spend the whole year bouncing between 30 to 60,000 the kind conditions that are terrible for traders but rewarding rewarding for accumulators with a multi-year calendar so this is what we're doing Ethereum can serve as money but has created a platform to tokenize all assets and create a massive internet platform of value it is much bigger than Bitcoin potentially so we already talked about so Ethereum has more potential even uh, overtake Bitcoin in market cap terms next piece of news is quant analyst plan b says bitcoin currently presenting best opportunity for bulls in the in the entire history of bitcoin the risk of being called a moon boy or the signals whether you look fundamentally like stock to flow for example or on chain realize cap or other metrics or in the news the macro news the number of countries that are opening up to bitcoin so of course there can be a black swan of course something can happen that we haven't seen in the past or that is a real black swan but uh, volatility is low the futures premium is low so this is why he thinks that bitcoin can running up and why i watch that like a hawk i that will go up again the dormant coins the people in profit the people in loss i can't imagine unless a black swan any other scenario that this is one of the best buying opportunities that we have seen in the entire history of Bitcoin is compatible to the beginning of 2016 2011 2013 2012 even the beginning of the bull run I know that sounds like Mumbai stuff but that's how I look at it and Bitcoin could skyrocket close to 300,000 sometime this year guys this is great next piece of news is analysts say bitcoin has already capitulated target 41,300 as the most hold level i think we are now about this level so that's a good news on chain analyst also doing this stuff here whereas accumulate near 40,000, and this is a kind of volume profile a heat map or whatever and you see that whales filter the only whale bitcoin so whales accumulated in this zone a largely significant portion of whale holdings reside between 38 and 42,000 right now little area for bitcoin above it bullish below it bearish analysts say most of the market has already capitulated bitcoin short and long 
term hodlers urpd and this is showing the short-term hodlers cost basis con uh, concentration between 38 uh, and 50,000 us dollar long-term holders currently holding coins at loss 15 percent of coins outside exchanges so almost you see this is a kind of heat map you see that who is holding and how much coins in um, <clears throat> loss so long-term holders can just uh, uh, wait and, and sitting in loss but short-term holders are not so, so patience cool however under the surface it, it appears as tough a huge swath of the market has already capitulated in a uh, statistically significant manner and the resilient inflow of demand between 35 to 42,000 range has quietly absorbed so this is a uh, inverse head and shoulders so that's a good sign on the four hourly guys let's go and check our next news apecoin a Ape price climbs 55 percent in three days as a board ap club drop drop rumor goes live so this is insane board ap club land air drop is getting closer and if you are holding apecoin or or board ap club then you can get an airdrop for this so this is the first breakout that we see on the board it yacht club coin bitcoin ethereum technical analysis bit up to 32,500 selling as bullish momentum continues okay so uh, we bounced and also rsi is breaking these horizontal levels and also ethereum is not so bullish right now but ethereum rallying uh, if it, it will running if 31 uh, 3100 uh, us dollar levels will be broken up ethereum could stay strong rally if it clears key resistance so clear resistance uh, 3150 us dollar levels so definitely watch these levels and also this uh, trend line on the one hourly chart dips supported in ethereum so i think uh, ev everything that is dropping uh, around 3000 that uh, it will be bought up <coughs> so guys uh, check out our farms and uh, go uh, to uniswap and pancakes so provide some liquidity lock up your lps and earn up to 330 percent aprs uh, follow me uh, on twitter and also follow korean platform and check out our tweets about super trend and also plans sees tweet that the bottom is in and also that uh, maybe bitcoin is not so correlated to the stock market because we see that bitcoin uh, is higher than other uh, stocks in loss and also the tweet from terra luna that bear us be aware and rec capital share this that uh, whales are still accumulating uh, and uh, the retail fomo is not here yet so this is a good uh, sign because the google search volume is just uh is at two years lows and this is the sign that retail is not in yet so th the real pump will come when retail will uh get into so guys that's it for today smash those like push the bell notification or subscribe to the channel see you tomorrow bye bye